Newcastle United's new owners have big ambitions, which involve targeting world-class names. Newcastle United director Amanda Stavely HASNT ruled out the prospect of the club targeting players of Kylian Mbappe's caliber in upcoming years. Mike Ashley completed the £305 million sale of Newcastle on Thursday, ending his 14-year spell at the helm, and the new owners have big ambitions. A Saudi-backed consortium, led by Stavely, has completed its takeover, leading to exciting times ahead for Magpies supporters. While Stavely and the Rubin brothers have equally split 20% of ownership, Saudi Arabia's public investment fund, PIF, worth a reported £320 billion, own 80%. The Magpies' new higher-ups are 10 times wealthier than Manchester City and PSG's combined, leading many to expect significant investment. And Stavely has confirmed that Newcastle are looking to sign world-class names once again, suggesting that the club make moves in January. She told the Mirror, we are in the market to compete for world-class players, we have done it before. But we need the infrastructure around the world-class players. We will get there, and we already have world-class players. We want to make sure they have the support around them. You do need a big balance sheet in football, but we are not here to be irrational. It is a state investment fund and there to look after the people, we have to do a full review, where the operations are, what we are looking at in January, but it is going to take a little time. Ashley's exit has left Steve Bruce's position uncertain amid Newcastle's dismal start to the season, with the club still chasing their first win after eight games. Stavely will undoubtedly have a significant say in Bruce's future and has stated that things must improve on the pitch, this is a great team, and they should not be in 19th position. We need to challenge that straight away, and players also need to know they have our fullest support, Stavely explained.